All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into the news. But before we do any of that, I got to send a salute out to all of my gym stars. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BKA the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video. Bro, I can't get my hair to get right, man. I'm trying to grow my hair out a little bit, and I got like ultra curly hair so when i go in the shower and wash my hair man it like like you know how some people have to use the sponge to get this type of look right here i just wash my hair and put some conditioner in it and it just does this naturally automatically and i didn't even realize how long my hair was but i gotta get my shape ups and stuff like that so i'm not fresh from the barbershop today but anyway look got a lot to talk about a little bit a little bit of time to talk about it in and i just want to put this out there man look the stories that we cover i know it's sometimes may come off as if i'm coming off bias but when i come off bias man i come off bias on the side of the truth so if somebody or, or the side of right so there's right and wrong in, in nearly every situation and then sometimes you got you got gray areas right uh if there's right and wrong i'm, a, I'm always gonna come off on the side of right and if you don't think that the person that I'm that if you don't think that what I feel like is right or what I feel like is right and if we don't share the same uh more you know values of what's right and wrong you may think I'm coming off bias and I'm just championing for somebody but that's not the case it's just that I'm coming off on the side of right and what's right is right and what's wrong is wrong and I'm normally gonna have some facts to back it up which brings us to what we got today man late last night we had a free series it was a free series nobody was it was no money or whatever but chalk df and um and statistics they were playing each other now chalk came out and there was some controversy around it because statistics says he was just streaming this is all just just what i saw what i witnessed statistics were streaming chalk pulled up on him say he wanted to play him. they played the game uh played game one statistics won game one handily they played game two, Chalk won game two handily. And then after all of that, the I mean, they weren't supposed to play a series is what Statistics says. He says he thought it was just a, a, a quick one game. They played the first game, he beat him. Then they played the second game and Chalk beat him. After the second game is one to one, he asked him to take off the mascot. So Statistics asked Chalk to take off the mascot because he felt like it was a clear advantage. And uh, you know, when he thought it was just gonna run the ones, he just beat him and that was it. The second game, you know, you got, you got, you, you, you know, what, you know what a person's gonna do. You, you see their style, and plus you gonna get ball first. The second game, so it does make a difference or what have you. Now I do. Let, let's just go to the videotape real quick, man. We gonna go to the videotape real quick, um, and uh, because they actually got into a chat after this, they, they, and and, and we just, this straight from statistics stream. We are gonna let him, let him talk about it. That's that's your boy, your boy EJ in the background right there. Oh my God! And he said, you know, you just got to take that big mascot off. Now Chalk is out here playing with the mascot, but he has on the um, the Houston Rockets mascot. Everybody knows about the Houston Rockets mascot from sixteen, man. Let's let's just be real. But then this is like actually Brutal Sims' favorite mascot too. But. <laughs> hey, EJ, a fool, man. So what EJ is saying, EJ in the background saying that Chalk oh, should take the mask hey, off. Hey, Statistics hey, actually trying to be level-headed about it. Let me tell y'all exactly why. Let me tell y'all exactly why he got the mask out on and he don't want to take it off. One, on offense, he gets straight blow bys and I can't even know if I'm on body-to-body -body contact to this nigga. That's why. That's the first reason why he want to. He don't want to take it Everybody off. Everybody knows that's Second true. Second reason why he don't want to take it off because he's six three. On deep, bro, bro, come on, bro, take the mask out off, bro. Take the mask out off. Bro, bro, this is my. This, hey, hey, bro, look, 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 look. This, this bro, is this is why. Bro, bro, this, this is why. This is exactly why you don't want to take the mask out off, cause you know that you're six three and I'm six six, and I'm going to bully you every time if you take it off, my nigga. You bro, know, listen, bro, come, bro. That's true. Okay, but this is this is my question. Bro. So how but that's what I'm saying. Now they did say now now there is a point here. He says that we played the first game. I thought it was just gonna be a straight up a straight up one one. We were running a one. We're not gonna run a series. So 
Well, now, Chuck says, well, why is it a problem after you lose? I can agree with that. Like, it is it, it, it is, it is one of those things where it's like, it, it is like, okay, well, it's only a problem because you lost. But at the same time, statistics comes back with a valid point. Bro, nigga, this nigga's a seven foot guard. That's, He's a that, seven foot guard with 10 go. plus badges on every category. We hadn't even mentioned the fact that Chalk has 10, 10 plus badge points on each category. So he can get stats that he otherwise wouldn't have or badges that he otherwise wouldn't have. But that's not the point either. The fuck? It is what bro, it is. Bro, look, look, look. Is that why I stole the ball from you? But look, you nigga, you, you, stole, you stole the ball by luck. What the fuck, nigga, what is you saying? You stole the ball because you got extra. Okay, so Chuck tried to cite the fact that he stole the ball out of his hand. Statistics says that's just luck. I, I could go with that. That's what I'm saying, Quill. Like, bro. Now, what? Bro, what? Bro, and look, what is so hard about taking the mascot off? What's so hard? That's my question, bro. Why was it I not a problem? Why was it not a problem? Bro, why did you think bro, that? Bro, what is so... Bro, the one thing you wanted to do, the one thing you wanted to do was load into a stage. That was your one but thing look, you wanted to do. The yeah, you but but you the, the been second like you off. lose, the second you lose, you want to start switching things up. That's all I want. I wanted to load into a stage. Why, what you mean I wanted to load into a stage? We just going to listen to it and let them rock. I'm saying you took us from the park to the stage. So right when you said, let's go stage, you could have easily said, take the mascot off. I'm not running a series with you in a mascot. But instead, you want to wait till you lose a game. Then you oh, want to say, yeah, yeah, no lie. But, no, that's yeah, what yeah, I'm saying. That, 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 that. Look, no, that, this, I'm listening. This, I'm listening. That. No lie. I'm listening. Look, look, that, no lie. Nigga sound like my old English bro, I thought this nigga about to say some. I thought this nigga about to say some fucking shit related to this. But look, but look, it's a shit. Hey, but it's a shit. It's a it's a series. It's a series, bro. Take the mask out, off, bro. Okay, but why? But this is my question. Not, but I, it's like if you would have said. But it look, before, I would have taken off. Bro, no matter if it was before or afterwards, bro, the series is tied one one. While the series is tied one one, before we go any further, we both got one win. So it's even right now. Take the mask out off. It's one one. Well, I'm saying, why are you telling this me series is one one. It's basically like zero one. zero. It's not like it's not like I'm saying you bro, you went up one like, bro. Come on. This is like us in the middle of the game. Like, bro. <laughs> Yeah, like like we, we just we just listening. I, I'm, I'm gonna do my commentary hey, look. afterwards. Hey look, hey look, hey look, look, look. That's all. Hey look, does that make sense? Look, look. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. After the first game, but you tell me look. After the first game. game I didn't say shit about it. But after the second game, I noticed how much of an yeah. advantage you have. You I noticed. Because you won. I, I know. But look. Look. I noticed. I noticed. Bro, I noticed how much of an advantage you had with that shit, bro. So what was my advantage? Bro, look. Nigga, you a seven foot guard. <laughs> so what, okay, so what did it do? So what did it do? What do you mean? What did it do? It's helping you on defense and offense. What are you saying? I stole the ball out of your hands. I didn't get any contest. Bro, look, look, look. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna lie to you. You talking about that one steal. I swear to God, you didn't have that mascot on. I'm blowing by you every single play. Right or wrong. That's why you're keeping it on. No, at this point. Bro, 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 it's the, bro, look, look. Chop, chop, chop. Keep, hey, keep it 1,000 with me. Keep it 1,000 with me. So that mascot, that mascot, so and that mascot. At that point, Chalk just I'm left. Not helping this he nigga. Said Is that, that mascot not helping him play defense spazzy. on me? To me, Is it not? That's not spazzy. All right, so later on in that day, Chalk did a, Chalk did a, he, he went to Twitter and he did a Twitter live video and he said that, uh, he said that he left because statistics were spazzing. To me, that ain't spazzing. He's just trying to get his point across. Now, you might think they're spazzing, to me, spazzing is when I'm yelling at you, cursing at you, saying things about you. Right now, what he's saying is to me that he's just talking about the situation. Y'all let me know if that's spazzing or not. It's probably going to be split down the middle. Some, probably, some people are probably going to say that's spazzing. Some, probably, some people are probably going to think it's not spazzing. They're probably going to see it from my point of view. They're probably not going to see it from their point of view. But the thing of the fact of the matter is, what do you guys think? Do you think that he should be able to ask him to take the map first of all i feel like if you if you're doing wages or if you're just playing a series or doing any of that stuff the mascot should not be on all right so the first game they played this i'm just setting the scene the first game they played they pulled up they said oh, you want to run us you want to run a series i mean not run a series you want to play a game he said yes he got on he saw he had the mascot on he's like okay we're gonna beat him anyway second game he comes on chalk them get ball first and then like i said chalk ran them and then 
and then he said exactly what he said. I didn't realize how big of a how big of a of an advantage the mascot was until the second game when y'all just ran through us. That's fine. He admitted he lost and all that good stuff to me. I, I, I'm I'm cool with that. But I think the big the, the biggest the bigger thing is, bro. You know you can't pull up with a mascot on. Come on, man. Hey, look, man. If y'all don't want to believe me that having a mascot gives you a huge advantage, let's listen to the only other person in the community who has a mascot. Let's listen to my guy, Pool Boy Sam. Let's see what he says about the mascot. This mascot puts my guard from 6'6 to about like 6'10. Do y'all see that? Uh, I'm running it up with little bro kids. He's but on look. A glass cleaning lockdown, Superstar 1. Your boy, Big E3, 99 overall playmaker. But as you guys can see, like I said, kids is sick. No, kids is seven foot. Boom. We're going to stop it right there. He says, Sin says that he plays with the Spurs mascot. Okay, so this year when you got the mascot, there's no penalty for playing with the mascot. Last year, your guy was awkward. Dribbling was awkward. You couldn't tell things. You couldn't launch properly. All that good stuff. This year with the mascot, there's no penalty for playing with the mascot. You're as fast as you were. And, and the only thing is you're a bigger player. Sin just said that his guy is 6'6". The mascot makes this guy like 6'10". He says that the guy he's playing with kids is seven foot. Sin is like way taller than him. The mascot definitely gives you an advantage. But don't take my, my word for it. My mascot is looking like I'm seven foot. You right. Feel me? See, my so mascot is looking like I'm seven foot. Now, look at this. Now, we're going to go. We're gonna take one more thing from Sin. And then we're going to just let it ride. So that's the only reason I don't have jump shot career. I don't spend Look at no this. time trying to go get it. But as you guys can see how big this mascot is, how little, look how little this guard is compared to this mascot. You feel me? But this is the next thing. And it, it feels like I'm getting, I'm getting pass guards faster too with this mask. I've been playing, I've been playing with the mask. Listen, no, no, listen to what he said. It's faster too with this mask. Listen to I'm what getting, he said. I'm getting pass guards faster too with this mask. One more I've time. Playing, I've been playing with, and it, it feels like I'm getting, I'm getting pass guards faster too with this mask. I've been playing, I've been. Case closed or what? So only thing I'm saying is, all right, so we got, we got statistics. He played him. He beat him the first time, lost the second game. That's when he asked him to take the mascot off. The series is 1-1. I don't see why you wouldn't take the mascot off. He should just take the mascot off at that point. Chalk does have a very valid point when he says, well, why is it a problem after I won? I mean, it is what it is. I mean, most things only become a problem after you win. I'm not going to lie about that. But to say that you, but to, to try to play the fact that you don't, I mean, he's right about that. So we got one and one. Statistics asked him to take it off. And he does have an advantage. Chuck, he only it only became a problem after you after you um after after I won a game. But at the same time, to try to act pre to pretend that you don't have an inherent advantage by playing with the mascot, come on, man. I don't know. Y'all, let me know who y'all think is right or wrong. I mean, in this side, I can see both points of view, but I tend to I, I tend to probably say I will I will rock with statistics on this one, but. But it's hard for me to do that at the same time. But everybody know you got an advantage. With 2K16, you play 2K16, you know you got an advantage playing with a doggone mascot. Let's be real. It makes you guy seven foot. And I used to play center on 16, and I hated playing the, the mascot that either had the heat mascot or the magic mascot. Come on, man. Y'all know this. This stuff is not new. That's the only reason that I'm, like, shaded towards the tizzy, because we know that the mascot gives you a thing. But at the same time, Chalk does have a valid point. Why is it an issue right here? But... The final nail in the coffin is, but I mean, I get that. But we're one one. Why not just take it off? I don't know, man. It is what it is. Cause you know it gives you an advantage. Let's just be real. You know it gives you an advantage. You got a six three guard. Now he's seven feet tall. He's he's playing better defense. You got the fattest, one of the fattest mascots in the game. It's hard to get, but come on, man. You know what it is, man. You can't really blow by him, and they're gonna give you Hall of Fame clamps. Is it this is one of those situations, it's real easy to see um what the side is, but Chalk does have a valid point. It only became an issue after you lost. But now it's even. Let's just play the series out. But he didn't play the series. He said that statistics were spazzing and all that. I didn't feel like statistics were spazzing. I feel like if you if you feel like that spazzing, you couldn't make it in any of our 2K parties. And that's okay. Because, you know, we get into it all the time. I guess it's just different cultures, man. Like, 
us, me and T Mizzle, we get into it all the time. We outright yelling at each other, and that's my dude. I call him every day. We talk for an hour or so every day. Who don't yell at they boy when they playing 2K? Like if that's spazzing then like I I don't I don't how you gonna make it, you know, trying to play in, in the rec leagues or or in the WR or or even in uh in 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 the 2K in 2K league. You gonna just leave out of all of them. So that's that I think that's what I had a problem with when Chalk was like he was spazzing and then he just killed the series. He, and, and I felt like it was probably because he didn't want to take the mascot off. Maybe he would have taken the mask out off, but then, like I said, he took the Twitter, did a live video. I, I think all that stuff is invalid, man. I, I, I can see statistics point more in this situation. Like, uh, I mean, I did play. It's like almost like, I'm like, bro, I did you a favor by playing with that. Now I'm just asking you to take it off. It is what it is, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments, man. Uh, look, also, hey, we got word from your boy Spiritual Soul, man. He talking about... Uh, um, he's talking, I spent way too long on that segment, but we got word from your boy Spiritual Soul, man. Hey, uh, look, he talks about, he's talking about, uh, 2K20, and, uh, let's just listen. But I'm back on this shit. Now, let me show y'all something real quick. Let me show y'all something. Now, I've not been rocking with So since he's been on the spiritual movement. I've been trying to grind 2K, but... He does indeed have a 2K player. 15,000 likes. 15,000 likes. I dropped my first uh 2K debut gameplay today. I'm not going to talk too much about I'm not going to talk too much about 2K right now because it has nothing to do with this video. But I want y'all to know I haven't really been playing 2K. It's one of the worst. This is one of the worst games that I have ever seen in my life. One of the worst games I have ever seen in my life. But this is my seven this is my 6 foot 7 point guy. If I don't know and that's it right there, man. That's that's all we got right there for that. Like he says that he says that he's gonna drop his game, but he really don't like the game. And a lot of people don't like the game. I don't know if he doesn't like the game. What do y'all think? Do y'all think he doesn't like the game because he he hasn't played it enough, or do y'all just feel like it's trash? I mean, is is that really where we are? Like like the game itself will survive, right? We don't have to worry about that. We do we do we would like to have uh. Com content creators on the game because it's called earned media but at the same time we don't need the earned media in order for the game to be successful that's how 2k feels y'all if, if you don't know what earned media is I, i'll explain that at another time but it just shows you that i'm on a whole nother level of of this stuff and i understand how this thing works earned media is nice but it's not necessary to sell the game it is what it is now so luminati has not since that point dropped his um he he hadn't dropped it he hadn't dropped that 2k video but i don't know if that video got 15,000 likes let's check and see if that video got 15,000 likes it uh yeah it got 30,000 likes so maybe he is gonna drop that 2k video pretty soon but you know it is what it is i don't know it can so luminati save the 2k community i don't know man y'all let me know but last but not least we had uh we had uh rat versus t-jack last night and uh rat took the uh he, he beat t-jack and uh <laughs> Bro, EJ is an idiot, man. Let me show y'all this right here, man. So after after that L, um, T uh, T Jack seems like he blocked EJ on Twitter, and uh, this is what your boy EJ had to say about it, man. T Jack, I just wanna know, nigga. Look, 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 cowboy. I just wanna know. Look, look. At what point during the wager against my boy Annoying? At what point did you know you were about to lose this motherfucking nigga? Look, look, look. I ain't see it. I ain't see it. Look, I'm bro, crazy. what's up with these head pieces he be having on, no, bro? Hank lost five the other day, nigga. Hank lost five the other day, nigga. You lost two. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's seven thousand dollars, nigga. Y'all lost in the TW house, nigga. That's seven thousand. Y'all niggas done lost in the TW house, nigga. But look, look, look. T Jack, this is not what the video about. T Jack, the video was. Look, look. I heard you block me, nigga. I seen you block me on Twitter, nigga. I, I, I'm sorry, dog. You. T I talked about your girl busted ass ass forces. I'm sorry, bro. Oh. I, I just came from the mall, though, nigga. I just came from the mall, nigga. And I got some for her. Don't don't let look, TJ. Don't let her know it's for me. I'm a nigga. She, she probably don't like niggas. Don't let her know it's for me. <laughs> idiot, it's, it's, man. it's a friend of the family, nigga. Look, look, look. I got some for you. A friend of the family, right? If he got black forces, what I'm gonna that? die. I already seen the video. I know what he got. <laughs> <laughs> she gonna love these. Big foot motherfucker. She she wet my side. I don't give a fuck nobody say. The way hey. I don't give a fuck nobody. She wear my side. <laughs> she wear my side. I know she wear my side. She, she look like she's oh like a 10 and a half. She wear these, man. She wear these. These brand new. These brand new, T-Jack. 
I'm going to just send me the address, nigga. Look, look, look. When you Bro, send it to me, nigga, write I, it real slow. Write it in real slow. Now, I'm a nigga. All right, man. Y'all go check that video out if y'all want to. It's on Twitter. But anyway, like I said, bro, we already knew he was going to have them Black Air Forces out there, man. Look, I don't know, man. But he said TJ blocked him. So, like, was TJ justified? I guess it was. I don't know what the whole thing was, why he might have blocked him or whatever. But it's just hilarious to me. But like I said, man, uh, who y'all think was right, man? Do y'all think, think that if you start, first of all, I feel like I, you could you could make a case either way. You could say if you start the series like that, then that's the way that you that you have to uh, that you have to finish it. But at the same time, we can say, I like I said, I didn't really like 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 uh, statistics said, I didn't realize it was that big of an advantage until you got ball first, and then you just ran through me, and it's like I, there's nothing I could do, and I know you can't do that with your regular guard because your regular guard is six three. And he's not going to be able to do that. He's not going to be able to play defense like that. He's not going to be able to do any of that. A lot of people try to say that it's just visual. Come on, man. That's why people got the huge afros, because we know that makes you a little bit taller. That's why people got the foam fingers, because we know that makes your fingers a little bit longer. And they, it's, nothing in this game is just visual. They would have you to believe that it's just visual, and he's not really seven foot, and he's not going to bully you like a seven foot. But poor boy Sin already told you that that it's, it, it's like that. But like I said... I can see both. I can see both perspectives. Why did it only become an issue after that? But the nail in the coffin is: if you really feel like it's not an advantage, why don't you just take it off? It is what it is. It's your right to not take it off. It's your right to just keep it, and it's your right to leave just like you left. But don't try to say the man was spazzing, my guy. He wasn't spazzing. To me, that ain't spazzing. But if that's spazzing to you, that's spazzing to you. If you got like, you know what I'm saying, like, like. I, I was everybody's skin ain't ain't the same. So if your skin is thinner than the next person, then you know maybe that is spazzing to you. That's that wasn't spazzing to me, man. It is what it is. But like I said, salute to both of them guys, man. Uh, in that situation, I just felt like it's one of those where we just wanted to see a series. We don't care who it was. We want to see good competition, and we were deprived from the good competition because of a dispute that didn't have to be had. It didn't have to be had at all. Like, he could have just taken the mascot off. But I think going forward, what y'all think? Going forward, we, any wages, any series, any stuff like that, do we need to take the mascots off? Or, or mascots fair game because you grind it for them? That's what I want to get to the bottom of. I really want to know you guys' opinion. I just, I just put the information out there, and I want to know you guys' opinion. But on the side of right, like, I'm going to be real with you. I wouldn't play with the mascot. I would have came out there, saw that you had the mascot on, and been like, hey, bro, this, this ain't running. We're we, we not doing this. I'm not going to play you with the mascot on. I would have said it before the first game even started. I probably would have quit out of that game and reset the whole thing or just stood by let you score and do it like that and then ask you to take it off. And then, you know, if you said it wasn't a problem, you didn't want to take it off, then I reserve the right not to play you as well. So that's, that's just that. But if you want the series to go on, then why not just take it off? I don't know. It is what it is. Like I said, it's his right not to take it off. So so you can't get... I ain't going to say neither one of them right or wrong. But if I had to say one gun to my head, hey, you, you got to take the mascot off, bro. You know that's an advantage. Let's be real. Nah, I ain't even going to hold my tongue, bro. You know that's an advantage. You know that there's an advantage to playing with a mascot. That's why you got it on. That's why you got it on a 6'3 player and now you seven foot. And you know it's an advantage. It is what it is. But hey, who am I? I'm nobody in the community. I got no subs. I get no views. I got none of that stuff, man. So what I say really is you take it with a grain of salt, man. I don't know what I'm talking about, but I know what I'm talking about on this one, man. Sometimes you got to call it like you see it, man. I ain't taking this, I ain't taking this side, but I'm just saying, I bet if CN plays a series, they're going to tell him, bro, you got to take the mascot off, especially if, if it was anything other than free. But then again, it was a free series. I don't know, man. I don't talk too long about this crap. I mean, it really ain't important. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments. Leave a like on the video and uh, let me know what y'all think. And I'm out of here. Until next time, it's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Godspeed!